Today is the arrival of the play fighting herbalist and also let me just take the Santa Cosmetics that wasn't able to purchase during its previous visit here in home. <laughs> And now for the This Style event currencies and also today is the 11th day for the event and our location today is going to be here on top of Vault of Knowledge Summit. Look at this magical area. Okay, let's take our shared memory. Let's do, just do some recording here and also sharing a memory in the this style runway we are rewarded with lights by the event guide And also we got merged with Newbie. Let's say hi to Newbie. Hello there Newbie. Okay, here is for the first stop hat just near or beside the shared memory. Then second one is gonna be here behind this chair, then in the closet and under the runway. Also, since I wasn't able to see some of my friends' shared memory here in the area, I just did restart my application and then went back to see this. So in total, I should we should be able to get 5 event currencies and also this is just this memory. <laughs> Hello there Jazlyn! And now time for the dailies. Our dailies today are going to be here in Hidden Forest. They are easy although some, especially the beginners, might get confused on where to find the spirit to relieve today. And first that we are going to be doing is to collect or catch the light here in the clearing. It should be flying around the clearing here before the rainy forest. It should be here. There we go then we are gonna go charge our cape on light bloom so to charge our cape on the light bloom the first thing that we have to do is to fully deplete all of our cape energy then we just have to get closer to the light bloom and the quest should be done And once we have our cape fully depleted, next thing that we have to do is to get near this light bloom. Over here, there we go. The next is we are gonna relieve the Pouty Porter, which is just here in the forest book. Now this is the last memory and the next thing that we are going to be doing is to head to the broken bridge to collect the orange light. Now to perform this task, there are two ways where we can do it easily. One is by lighting the white candles at the end of the bridge, basically summoning the jellyfish, switching out the rain 
and second is by waiting underneath the fallen tree branch near the butterflies and the fastest way though is by chasing it right away although this requires a lot of cape strength now right now let's go to the Goto wasteland to collect our daily treasure candles so the first one's gonna be here before the exit here at the right side and next is we are gonna head to the crab fields in front of the shipwreck now be careful though cause the treasure candle station is also part of the creels pathway now right the next is we are gonna go to the graveyards exit or before the stairs to the battlefield i really don't recommend the rider i'm using here cause there are four courses gonna greet you after this area and there's a safest route where you had to go first to the battlefield and head back to the graveyard so it should be here yeah just be careful from the creels because <laughs> they're just everywhere then the last treasure candle spot is on top of a wall in the battlefield uh, specifically in the front wall it's over here and there's a guys thank you so much for watching i hope you find this video helpful bye everyone see you next time and also don't forget to join my season pass giveaway linked in the de description below